What is up guys, GCNSC here and welcome to a new squad builder, but firstly I want to say if you can buy some old team coins, go check out cheapfutcoins.co.uk, uh, they're very cheap and they only do Xbox coins at the moment, uh, but like I said they're one of the cheapest around, so link to them in the description below, and uh, I'm going to explain what this squad builder is going to be about, um, it may say hybrid than tight, I'm not too sure, uh, but whether you guys consider it hybrid or not, uh, it's all up to you, um, but it's going to be the Champions League uh, knockout stages start in a couple of weeks, and uh, I decided to do a hybrid, uh, or a team, with both teams uh, that are in each uh, each match. And this, the first one is going to be Celtic versus Juventus. Um, so this team, uh, it's obvious in the title, this could be a Celtic and Juventus team. And uh, it's going to include most of the forms I can try and fit in. Um, and there are some tasty fixtures coming up in this uh, Champions League, such as Real Madrid versus Manchester United. So that's a big one. Uh, that will be a very nice squad as well, guys. So that's something to look forward to. Uh, but we're going to start this team off. It's a 4-4-1-1. Four, four, one, one. And in goal, we're going to have Gianluigi Booth on. There he is. Uh, I've used him a lot of squads. He is an 87-rated goalkeeper, and he's one of my favourite on the game. Uh, costing 43,000 coins, so he is quite pricey. But he's 6 at 3, and he's got some incredible stats on his card. Uh, re recommend using him. Um, and I, I want to use the best players from each club, so Booth on is a must. Uh, centre back then, the first one we have is a 84 rated player, and that is Barzagli. Um, both centre backs are actually very solid. I'll put both in at the same time. So it's Chiellini and Barzagli. Um, Barzagli, though, he's six at one. He's only got 68 pace, so he's quite a bit slower than um, Chiellini. But his defending stats and his heading stat are very, very impressive. Uh, for 1,600 coins as well, um, he's really, really uh, decent. Um, 86 defending and 81 heading. Um, like I said, though, only 68 pace. That's a bit of a letdown, but with uh, this guy next to him, Chiellini, uh, he's 6 at 1, so he's the same height, but he's got 80 pace, 86 defending, and 84 heading as well. So uh, this guy really is a tank at the back. He costs him 20,000 coins as well, um, but th th this this trio is just so good. Um, but uh, I'll go to the right back now, and uh, there's a choice of two you can have. I, I went with Caceres, or uh, I think that's how you say his name. Anyway, um, he's a very, very solid right back. Uh, you can have Lichtensteiner instead. Uh, but I've gone with Caceres though, as he is 6 foot tall, he's got 83 pace, 80 defending and 80 uh, heading as well. Um, and this guy on the ball is pretty decent as well, 70 dribbling and 70 passing. And 900 coins as well, that is pretty much the scar value. Um, but last year he was in fact a centre back by default. Um, so I'm quite disappointed he's not there anymore, but obviously if he plays right back in real life they can't really change that. Uh, left back we have the first Celtic player and that is going to be Izaguire. I can't really pronounce his name, but he's from Honduras. And it costs me 19,000 coins, so he is quite uh, pricey for a left back. Uh, but he has got 80 pace, 74 defending, and 72 passing in his key stats. Um, he's got 4-star weak foot, which is quite nice. Um, and he's a decent left back, and I believe he's the best left back uh, on the game. At left mid, we have another Celtic player, and that is big Giorgio Samaras. So there, I don't, I'm not going to lie, I've seen this guy play quite a bit. And I don't know where they got that 83 pace from, but he's six foot four, um, 83 pace, 73 dribbling, and 71 heading. Um, but that height is just that height and pace combo is outstanding. Um, he cost me 1,300 coins, and his crossing is really, really good. Um, the first set of mid we could have then is going to be in form player, and that is in form Marquisio. Uh, I love this normal card, one of my favourite midfielders on the game, and I must say this in form version is. It's just got a little bit of edge over the normal version. Uh, but for 88,000 coins, that is quite a big price tag. You can always go the normal version. Um, but my, my Mark is yeah, four star weak foot, three star skills. And uh, also got an insane long shot. His on card stats are absolutely insane. Um, the lowest being the 73 heading. Everything else above that is uh, 77. So that is, that's pretty mental. Um, the other centre we're going to have is going to be another silver and a Celtic player. And that is Scott Brown, a surprise package of this team. He's got 84 pace, 74 defending, and he fit the centre mid role really, really well. He had to bag himself two goals, two pretty nice goals as well. And for 1,700 coins, I think he's a really, really good uh, bargain. Um, and finish off the midfield at right mid, we're going to have another bargain of this team, as Forest of Celtic. Um, this guy seemed a lot quicker than he actually was. Three star skills, three star weak foot. Um, it, I think if you had a team of him at right forward, he would do a lot of damage. Um, but at right wing, uh, right mid, sorry, I've done a lot of good runs of him. And uh, he's also good, good at getting assists. At uh, centre forward, we have another informed player, and that is going to be informed Matri. Uh, this guy has got quite a bit of pace. That is 85. He's six foot tall, so he's not short, and he's also got 77 shooting and uh, 82 heading as well. Um, this guy actually scored a scorpion kick for me. That'll be in the clips at the end. Uh, I don't know why he done it, but it's still a pretty nice finish. Uh, that is going to be the final Juventus player of this team, and finishing off the team overall, we're going to have Gary Hooper in form. Um, probably, I'd say a bit of a disappointment really. Um, his, his shooting is pretty poor. Um, 
Like his pace is okay, uh, but his shooting wasn't really up to scratch what I thought it'd be. Uh, but for 13,000 coins, they can't really moan. Uh, he did do the job and he came up with a few vital goals. Uh, but Matry was probably my key player of this team, as well as uh, Scott Brown. Um, but guys, that has been the first team, the Celtic vs Juventus. Uh, I'm not going to call it a hybrid, or we'll just call it Celtic vs yeah, Juventus team. Um, on the bench, we have Giovinco, De Kegli, or De Ceglia, sorry, Asamoah, Vucinic, Forster, uh, Miku, and Rogni. They're, them three Celtic players I actually had laying around my club. Um, but that is going to be the bench as well, guys. So if you could drop a like and you like the concept of this series, uh, a like is always appreciated. A uh, subscription, if you're new to the channel, is also uh, much appreciated again. And uh, thank you guys for 41,000 subscribers, which is incredible. So thank you for watching this video. Please drop a like, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.